Good evening, teachers. Good evening. Uh, por ahí estuve viendo sus mensajes, Carolina. Ah, sí, teacher, que he estado quebrándome la cabeza. Eh, a ver, el ejercicio. Este, ¿verdad? Yes. Vaya. Eh. Y esto no. Esto aplica lo que siempre les he dicho. Si la pregunta es con do, vamos a usar do. Si es con das, si es con did. La primera teacher es yes. I, si fuera positiva. Ok. Si la primera es positiva es yes, I was. Como dice corta. Exacto. Pero así lo, así lo, pues, así lo tengo. Y, así lo tengo y no me lo agarra. A mí ya me pro... dieron todas buenas. Yo la que tengo problemas es en la 13, que ni para atrás ni para adelante. Solo dos me han salido buenas en la 13. Pero en esta sí todas me... Es que creo que usted le está agregando... Eh, Carolina. Ley. Ley. En este pero caso. como ahí. Pero no, es que, ahí, ahí lo que pasa es que yo le. Sobre... Lo que pasa es que yo he probado de todas formas. Poniéndole ley, quitándole ley, poniéndole guas. O sea, a, a, a ver a dónde me daba, pero no me dio por ningún lado. Pero... Quizás porque no le pone coma, Caro. ¿Cómo no? Tiene la coma, fíjese. Y el punto. Pero, pero mire. No sé. Ajá. Sí. Bueno, voy a probar. Porque la segunda... Eh, Teacher, a mí en la, a mí en la 13. Pero ya la 15 sí me salió todo bien. La 13... La 13... La 13... Déjenme revisar si ya la corrigieron, porque tenía un error. La 13 es el, el verbo. Eh, en la primera es el verbo. También la también la primera. En la 13, de la 3 en la, la 3 y la, de la 3 a la 5 no me da. Pero ahí yo creí que todas eran por no y, y, y arreglé eso y no, también un verbo y tampoco. Teacher, pero miren la pregunta es que en la 15 eh, también lo que tiende a confundir que dice en una que la respuesta puede ser negativa o puede ser positiva. Entonces, sí. para, ajá, pero para saber, para saber cuál es negativa, cuál es positiva. No, okay. lo que le quiere decir ahí es que cualquiera de las dos le acepta, ya sea que usted responda ah. afirmativo o negativo. Ok. Ok. 
bueno, voy a seguir probando a ver si me da, porque eh, en la primera sí yo tenía yes I was, en la otra tengo I was not, yes he was, yes she was, y en la última igual no it wasn't o yes it was, pero no me da. Pero ese sí está, está bien, Martina. Eh, Yo estoy viendo la página que usted envió, donde tenía todos los apuntes. Sí. Eh, y la, la más próxima a la, a la correcta, usted le ha agregado el. Yes, I was late. No, I was. Ah, es late. que le, el, si se fija, yo le puse. Eh, yes, I, 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 I late, I late porque era como opcional, lo puse por eso entre paréntesis, pero probé sin ponérselo y tampoco no me daba. Pero voy a seguir ahí probando a ver qué pasa. Sí. Okay, people, let's get it started tonight. Welcome one more time. Let's see. We're going to start with the first attendance, okay? So remember that it's a requirement to have your cameras on, not only for the attendance, but for the whole class. <clears throat> I know you don't care about that, but I have to tell. <laughs> Okay. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Is not here, Miguel. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. We cannot hear you, Miguel. Okay. Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay, good evening. Thank Claudia you. Guadalupe Arias. You said that is no. Okay. Uh, Senaida America Dominguez. Present teacher. Okay. 
Perdón, teacher, me tomo nota ahí. Ah, uh, oh, Miguel. Okay. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Ok, present, teacher. Ah, ok. Hilda Xiomara Siano. Present, teacher. Okay. Ana Delmi Herrera. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Linda Stephanie Ramírez. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Turn on your camera, Marisol. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Carla Verónica Zuria. Present teacher. Ok. Welcome. Ángel Alexander Guardado. No. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Oh. Ok. <laughs> Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present teacher. Okay, don't work too much, Mayra. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. No. Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Present teacher. Okay. Silvia Zuleima Rodríguez. Present teacher. Okay, turn on your camera. Silvio Enrique Cortez. Present. Okay. Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Okay, Joana, turn on your camera, Joana. I'm eating, teacher. Huh? I'm eating. Oh, you're later. eating. Okay. Yes. Give me a pair of minutes, please. Okay. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Ya llegó. Present teacher. Okay. Linda Stephanie. Nelson Iván. Carla. No. Eh, Angel Alexander. Carlos Alberto. Oh, yeah. Okay, people, welcome to the jungle. Welcome one more time. Okay, tonight we are going to start lesson four, unit three. Um, well, we have not studied this topic. Give me a second, just let me take a look. Three, this is today. And here is that. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, I was checking some the book because this book is crazy. Okay, let's get it started. Let me share the screen. De ayer no nos quedó nada pendiente. No. Perfect. Let me share the screen. Wow. 
Bueno, después, antes de terminar, me acuerdan de, de revisar con todos los, los errorcitos que hay en la, en la página. Algunos me los han mencionado para... Ayer lo reporté, dos errores que me, han, que me han mencionado. Supuestamente ya los arreglaron, pero estoy viendo y por lo menos en la mía aparecen igual todavía. Así es que lo vamos a ver después para si quieren adelantar. Porque incluso hay, un, hay unas tareas ahí, esa lección 13, que es del WAS que no está acá, sino hasta la unidad 4, pero ahí está el, la tarea en la unidad 3. ¿Verdad? Ah, así es que lo vamos a ver eh, para explicarles ahí el errorcito que hay. Y había otro en la 16 también. Es que me acuerdan, ¿verdad? Antes de irnos para que así a mañana esté todo con completo como siempre lo hace. ¿Ok? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay, tonight, tonight's objective is you will be able to talk about activities you are doing at your workplace. Activities that you are doing at the moment, okay? Um, there are a couple of questions here. What are some qualities a good employee needs to have? Um, what are some qualities a good employee needs to have? Think about that. Good. Responsible. Okay. Honesty. Responsible. Polite. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Let's do something. Write in the chat, please. Write in the chat. The qualities of a good employee. Obedient. <laughs> Good employee must be obedient. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. I'm not a good employee. Because I'm not too obedient. Punctuality. Effective. How effective. Good. Punctuality. Come on, people, right? Or aren't you good employees? Are you a good employee? Huh? Teacher. Honesty. Okay. I am good employee. Oh, Olga says I'm good employee. Yes. He's looking for the Christmas bonus. <laughs> <Hi>. <laughs> Responsible in English, Marisol. Good presentation. English, Marisol. Very kind. I'm a lawyer. Sorry, teach. <laughs> Polite. I'm a loyal, loyal. Okay. Good. Good presentation. Responsibility. Good presentation. Okay. Uh -huh. Honesty, reliable, okay. Uh -huh. That's all people and the others. Come on. Something different. Innovation. Innovator, okay. Proactive, okay. Obedient, nadie pone obedient. Aren't <laughs> fast, 
A ver, a ver, a ver, Zenaida. A ver, a ver, a ver. Eso ya lo vimos, Zenaida. ¿Cómo se pone? Ajá, loyal. And Zenaida, you can do it. Learner, ajá. Learn, learner. Okay, very good. And then the other question is, is mm, what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? Promotion, un, yes. Yeah. You know what is a promotion? Good image. Good image. The most essential quality to get a promotion. Which one is? Quality, quality and productivity. Ah, okay. Helpful. Ah, good to achieve goals, says Caroline. See, says Anaida. <laughs> what is he, <C>, Anaida? <laughs> hey, when I tell you to turn on the cameras, is when you turn them off. Nice. Oh, um, um, but you, you are you are not good students. You are not obedient. Ah. Uh -huh. No, les falta la más importante. I don't know how. Well, it doesn't have translation actually. Yo, yo, you must be yo, yo, if you want to get a promotion. You know what I mean? How do you say in English, yo, yo, teach? <laughs> yo, yo is yo, yo. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it in, in, in Spanish. What is that? And instead, and what does it yo, yo? Uh, friendly with the boss. <laughs> friendly with the boss. Okay, maybe. No, I'm kidding. Okay, those are the important qualities. Then. The ones that you have mentioned are the really important qualities. Okay, very good. Okay, talking about that, we're going to read this conversation. Um between Pedro and Max. Okay? So please listen. I'm going to read it first and then we are going to practice. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Regit. Good morning, Mr. Regit. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking on some references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what it is required at a managerial position? Ah, interesting. Okay, now please listen and repeat after me. Good morning, this is Mr. Pedro Regit. 
Good morning. Good morning. This is Mr. Good Pedro. Good morning. Bridget. Good morning. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Morning. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from Human Resource. How can I help you? I help you. Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? Okay. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. We are checking, we are checking on checking some on reference. Uh, we are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. Mr. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings and the feedback we have about him from his main supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what it is required at a I see. I, I see. see. Do you, do you, you consider, consider he has what he is required, required at a manager position? Mm. Okay. Very good. Very good. Now, I am Pedro and you are Max. Okay? Teacher. Teacher. Yes. ¿Cómo se pronuncia eh, HR? Tenemos que decir las iniciales. Yeah, HR. HR, okay. Y H por último, el R. HR. HR. R. Okay. Y en la última, managerial, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Managerial. Managerial position. Okay. okay. Yes, when you have uh, acronyms, Acronymos or siglas, ¿verdad? In English we say acronyms. You use HR. No? IPA. Okay. Um, okay. I am Pedro and you are Max. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, good morning, Mr. Rigid. This, this is Max from Human Resource. How, How I can, can I, I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. okay. What, what kind of information, information do you need? We are checking on some references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Mr. Sanchez does not, does not have any warnings in the, the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I, do you consider he has what it is required at a managerial position? Okay. Now you are Pedro and I am Max. So you begin. One, two, three. Good morning. This is Mr. Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. Hello. 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 Okay, dijo Ticho. Okay, dijo Ticho. Oh, se cortó. Okay, vamos. Okay, what, what kind of information do you need? 
We are, we are checking, checking all some, some reference. We are, we are playing romance text in a half man and year. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. <laughs> I see. I see. Do you consider what, what, what is required at a man managerial position? Okay, very good, very good. Any question with the conversation? No. So there are a couple of questions here. Three actually. What do you think are some of Mr. Sanchez's quality? Sanchez. What is the new role Mr. Sanchez will have at the company? What do you think is Mr. Sanchez's current role? So I'll give you 10 minutes to practice the conversation in pairs and to respond this question, okay? These questions. Okay. All right. Right. Okie dokie, let's see. Uh, break of rooms, 17. Ok, espero que todos estén disponibles para que no quede nadie solo. Go ahead, join your groups.
Miguel. Hola, hola, Miguel. Miguel. Hola, 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 ¿me escucha? Hello, hello. Hola, creo que acaba de entrar, ¿verdad? Sí, me acaba, es que estaba solo, pero ya me pusieron con usted. Ah, sí, ah, pues, si gusta, empecemos. Ok, pero solo permítanme ¿Sí? diez segundos, permítanme. Sí, está bien, está bien. What do you think Mr. Sánchez's current role is mm -hmm. feedback? Or supervisor? Uh, no. Uh, this is Max. This is Mr. Sanchez. Dos. No, no, no. Sé. Ya me confundí. We have about him from his. Él tiene información sobre por parte de su supervisor que le dice que él es responsable. Mm -hmm. Vamos a agarrar, vamos a agarrar al toro por los cuernos ahorita. <laughs> That's not. And the people have uh -huh. any one one in the feedback. Number Okay, number three. Number three. What do you think is Mr. Sanchez's current role? What do you think is Mr. Sanchez's qualidad, verdad? Is he responsible? Okay, Mr. Sanchez. Is responsible. What do you think is, are some? He is an employee responsible. He is responsible employee. And he is a responsible employee and a good employee. Because they don't have a uh, warnings. And that's only, only is the uh, situation of Mr. Sanchez. Warning. In, don't in have a good one. employee, the program. Employee. Mm -hmm. Because don't have any warning. Any warning. Or any personal actions. Okay. It's the same. Responsible. And, ay, ay, me cuesta con este PDF. Don't has sería, ¿verdad? Don't has. Don't has. Uh -huh. No, don't have. Como un empleado normal. <laughs> Sí, porque no habla en... en la anterior dice que el señor Sánchez no tiene advertencias ni falta. Ah, no habla sí. de ninguna posición. Ajá. No habla de que ella tenga algún, algún, este, algún puesto. Ajá. Un, un peón. 
Sí. Un empleado, pongámosle nomás. Employees. No, employees. Eh, aquí está el teacher. Hello. Eh, I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, what is current role? Current. Current. Actual. Uh, okay. Mr. Sanchez employees. <laughs> It's only employee. Sí, porque ya no dicen, creo que no dicen en ninguna parte que sea algo. Que lo van a promover, sí. Sí, porque ahí es como que entiendo que dice de que, que el supervisor dice que él es un responsable. En la, convers en la última conversación de Max. Sí. Si quiere repasemos otro rato la conversación. Yo creo que esas son las respuestas. Ok. Bueno, empieza usted.
Okay, welcome back. Oh, well, check here. What do you think are some of Mr. Sanchez's qualities? Tell me. Responsibility. Responsible. Responsibility. Responsible. 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 No. No, how in the world? What was that? Rayos. <laughs> Piritus Chocarreros, go away. <laughs> Teacher. <laughs> okay. Uh, responsible. Any other quality for Mr. Sanchez? No, have any warning. Ah, okay. In the field, but doesn't have. He doesn't have any warning. Okay. What is the new role for uh, Mr. Sanchez? What is the new role Mr. Sanchez will have at the company? Um, managerial position. So, manager. Manager. Uh -huh. manager. Manager. It's, it's yeah. manager. Managers. You will be a manager. What do you think is Mr. Sanchez's current role? Okay. Manager planning, mana managerial. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? The current role of Mr. Sanchez is supervisor. Ah, could be supervisor or vice manager, maybe vice manager. I think a good worker. A good worker. worker, just simple, a good worker, or yeah, okay, okay, very good. Well, I'm let sure me hear. I'm sorry, okay, let's see, let's start with the conversation with. Angel and Carla. Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay. I meet Pedro. Okay. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rijet. Good morning, Mr. Rijet. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would you like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez? Okay, what kind of information do you need? We're checking on some reference. We are planning to promote he has a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he's responsible? I see. Do you consider he has what is required? It's a manager position. Require. Require. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, very good, very good. Thank you. Now, please, Olga and Silvio. Okay. 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 You first on, on my. You. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigit. Good morning, Mr. Rigit. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? 
Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what it is required at managerial position? Good, very good. Please now, Claudia and Joanna. Okay. Uh, good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Reyes. Good morning, Mr. Reyes. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are planning to promote he as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warning. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he asked what it is required at a manager's position? Okay, very good. Now, please, Caroline and Nelson. Okay, Nelson. Nelson. Hello. Uh, you, Pedro. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rijet. Good morning, Mr. Rijet. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking um, some reference. We are planning to promote, promote, promote him as manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings in the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider it he has what is what is required at the managerial position? Okay, good. Now please, Denida and Sylvia. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Sylvia. Good morning, Mr. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are planning to promote, promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warning and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what is a required at the manage managerial position? Okay. Thank you. Continue, please, Marisol and Xiomara. Okay, teacher. Um, I'm Pedro. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Richet. 
Good morning, Mr. Regit. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have some more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warning. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsibly, res responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what, what, he, what he is required at a manag managerial position? Okay, very good. Please now continue Alejandra and Miguel. Okay, me, Pedro. Okay. Okay. Uh, good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Bien. No, Miguel. Wow, Miguel, are you there? Algo frisado. No, no, no. Hola, Miguel. Ya estás de regreso. No, está mordo, Miss. Ok. This is much from Sharp. How can I help you? No le escucho. There's more information about. Mm. Hello, Alejandro. Si gusta, empezamos. ¿no? Hello, hello, hello. Okay. Okay, one more time. A ver si ahora. Okay. Thank okay. You, Pedro. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. Working of information, do you know? We are checking on some reference. We are planning, planning to uh, promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warning. In the feedback we have about is from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you con consider he has what it is required at a man manager managerial position? Position? Okay, very good. Very good. Well, I'm going to take the second attendance and then we're going to have a feedback about this practice. Camera on. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present, present. Olga Marleni Gomez. Please. Present. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Senaida America Dominguez. Present teacher. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Ana Delmi Herrera. 
Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Present teacher. Linda Stephanie Ramírez. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Carla Verónica Suria. Present teacher. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present teacher. Present teacher. Ok, that was Nelson. And, and Angel, ok. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Good. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you, Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Carolina, Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Present teacher. Silvia Zuleima Rodríguez. Present teacher. Silvio Enrique Cortés. Present. Y Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Very good. Okay, now some feedback about the conversation practice. Let me share the whiteboard here. Okay, first, let me see. Well, this one require. Required. 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 Yes. Uh, well, this one, managerial. 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 This one. Planning. 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 Yes. This one. A ver. Singular is reference. Singular. Reference. Pero aquí está en plural. References. References. Okay. Tiene que escuchar esa extra sílaba al final. En singular, repito, es reference. But in plural, references. Okay, references. Esta otra, kind. Por ahí escuché varios decir kind. No, it's kind. Kind. Uh, esta, no muchos, ¿verdad? Pero... Recordarles el sonido suave de esto, ¿no? Information. Es un, es un sonido suave. In, de esa T, I, O, ¿verdad? Information. Algunos se les escucha information. Muy fuerte esa, esa ch. ¿Verdad? Es muy fuerte sonido más suave, information, mation, ok, imagínense un sonido como de SH, verdad, y no, Shh. information, y por último, aunque esto puede ser caprichoso, porque los nombres son un poco caprichosos, este nombre, verdad, eh, a mi entender es rigid. Rigid. ¿Por qué? Porque usualmente una doble E casi siempre es, ese es el sonido. I. ¿Verdad? Me recuerdan palabras como three. O three. O uh, otra palabra. B, 
abeja, ¿verdad? B. Entonces, doble E, así siempre suena I. Entonces, uh, algunos lo pronunciaban reject, pero no. Yo sé, como le repito, que los nombres son caprichosos. ¿Verdad? Pero sobre todo porque es un, es un apellido ca, algo así como de, de la India. Eh, tiende a, ese, a esa pronunciación. Y usualmente, como les digo, la doble E es, suena como I. Any question with the conversation? Um, teacher, ref, reference is reference. Reference singular. References plural. Plural. Okay. okay. Thank you. Teacher. Yes. Uh, any warning uh, is that similar to que no tiene acciones de personal, que no tiene como amonestaciones. Sí, eso sería amonestaciones, ¿verdad? No. Ok. Pertencias. Warning. Ok. Ok. Now, let's talk about this sentence. We are checking on some preferences. Yeah. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Okay. So this is what we call present continuous or present progressive. Right? Aquí está, ¿no? Present progressive. Teacher. Are you Hola. Presentation or the information. Oh, the only, no están I viendo el libro. Ah, vaya. No, no. Ok. Ah, sí, me quedé en la pizarra. Ok, ok. Thank you for letting me know. Thank you. Okay, I was telling you that these phrases in the conversation, we are checking on some preferences and we are planning to promote him as a manager are in present continuous or present progressive. Es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Present progressive or present continuous. We use the present progressive to talk about ongoing situations. Es decir, situations that are happening in that moment or in a continuous present. Ongoing situations. Okay? And you can also see the normal structure for basically affirmative sense. Yeah, subject, let me point out the subject here. Subject, for example, the sentence, we are updating the information this weekend. The subject is we. Then, always, esto por favor nunca lo olviden, siempre, el verb be. En este caso es are. Luego, el verbo principal va en su ing form. Y después todo esto que sería el complement. ¿Verdad? We are updating the information this weekend. The staff, this is the subject. Is the verb be 
planning the verb in ing form to give him a promotion. Okay? <clears throat> and in negative sentences, you only add the particle not. Después del verb be. I am not, we are not, you are not. Let me show you more examples about this. Oh, yes. Okay, oh. here. You see, affirmative, I am playing. Negative, I am not playing. Let me get that. Question, am I playing? Then you are playing. You aren't, the contraction for are not. You aren't playing. Are you playing? He or she or it is playing. Isn't playing. Is he playing? We are, y acá como es plural, ya usamos are. ¿verdad? We are playing, we aren't playing, are we playing? You are playing, you aren't playing, are you playing? They are playing, they aren't playing, are they playing? Okay? Recuerden también que las preguntas de información, recuerden les he mencionado ya, es prácticamente agregarle a la yes no question, la question word. Al principio, por ejemplo, si yo quiero hacer una pregunta de información, solo le agrego, when am I playing? Acá le puedo, si quiero hacer esto, una pregunta de información, solo le agrego otra, otra palabra de pregunta, Adecuada, where are you playing? ¿Verdad? La pregunta de información. Y así el resto. ¿Alguna pregunta? Recuerden este tema que ya se ha visto, ¿verdad? Creo yo. Ya escuché. Any question with this? Not the chair. Okay. Recuerden, es importante porque eso suele suceder. Se les olvida el verbo to be a la hora de usar esta forma. Y solo dicen I playing. No, 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 no es I playing. Es I am playing. Así como en español usted no dice yo jugando, no, ¿verdad? Sino que dice yo estoy jugando. Ahí va el verbo to be, el ser o estar. ¿Verdad? No dice you, you, uh, you playing, tú jugando. No, you are playing, tú estás jugando. Entonces igual. Como en español no olvidamos el verbo estar o ser. Eh, ahí tampoco lo olvidemos en inglés. Muy bien. Dicho eso, ya que no hay preguntas. Vámonos de nuevo al book. Y tenemos un par de... First exercise 
is write sentences using the present progressive forms of the verbs in parentheses. Plan, call, check, write, send, speak. Entonces, usando estos verbos van a escribir una oración. Por ejemplo, hago yo la primera como ejemplo. I am planning the birthday party for my uh, wife. Um, una oración usando el verbo en present progressive ok bien les doy tiempo para que hagan esto individualmente una cosa sin progresiones veamos yes. seis. Ah, no, seis. no seis ese es un ejemplo ok teacher <laughs> Hagan la suya. How much time? How much time? I think 10 minutes is enough. Okay. When you finish, raise your hand, okay?
teacher. Teacher. The teacher is asleep. Take a break. What happened, Angel? Tell me. ¿Será que, lo, que, ¿Será que en los tres tiempos? Negativo también. I only one sentences. Me too, Angel. Only I write only the. You can use the, for example, one in, in positive, two in negative, for example. But I, but I only one sentence. Okay, thank you.
Okay, now I will send you to the breakout rooms just to share your sentences, okay? Share, compare, discuss your sentences in your groups, okay? Give you five minutes for that. Okay. Están pasados. Number one. Number one. I am planning. 
my graduate for the next year. Okay. In the second year, I am calling to my boss. Number three, I'm checking my work for, for tomorrow. Okay, welcome back. I'd like to hear some of your sentences, okay? Let me start with Carla. Read me one of your sentences, anyone. Cada vez que regreso de los break and room, me está pasando esto con este speaker, que no me lo está agarrando. Carla? Yes, teacher, I'm sorry. I'm okay. Here. Okay, one sentence, please. Um, la cinco, teacher. Only one. Ah, um, she is a great, a great thing, a letter. Repeat, please. She is great, great thing, a letter. Ah, okay. Writing, writing a letter. Um, Good. She is a writing a letter. Teacher, no sé si me... Eh, Llamó algo, pero eh, estaba fallando el, el micrófono. No, 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 no. Ah, ok, ok. Ok, Nelson. One sentence, please. Yes. Ok. You are checking the social network. Good. Joana. Uh, 
Where is the teacher? Okay. I'm calling to my boss. Okay, Silvia, Suleima. Okay. Uh, todas, perdón. One, only one. Okay. Um, my boss is checking my work. Okay, Silvio. Four. One. One. Any, anyone. Anyone. Uh, number five, we aren't sending the packet for airway. Okay. Marisol. Okay. They are sending the report. Good. Xiomara. The number four. That I write in a letter. Okay. Uh, Miguel. Oh, teacher. Number five is uh, in all. Uh -huh. Any, any, anyone, anyone. Number six. Okay. Number six. I am playing basketball on Mondays. Good. Claudia? You are checking the shopping list. Good. Alejandra? I am planning to visit my family. Okay. Olga? Okay. My neighbors are speaking very loud. Okay. Carolina? Okay. Uh, Gustavo Mott sending that report card before Friday. Mm, repeat, please. Gustavo Mott sending that report card before Friday. Most sending. Yes. Mm. Tal vez sería is sending. Ah, okay. Is sending. Gustavo is sending that report card before Friday. Okay. Aunque okay. ahí el sentido es a futuro. Se usa también para futuro, no hay problema. Pero... Ah, okay. Entonces okay. Camila, Camila is writing the clay and visit report. Okay, good. ¿Verdad? Pero está bien anterior, o sea, sí, esta misma forma se usa para hablar de futuro. Okay, Zenaida. My son is speaking with his cousin. Okay, very good, very good. Um, now, there is another exercise here. Let me show you. Okay. You have to write a paragraph about the activities you are doing these days. Estos días, ¿verdad? En, esta, en estos días, eh, what activities you are doing. Ya sea at work, whether at work or, or in your personal life, okay? So you can write a paragraph with seven sentences about imaginary or real information about activities you are doing these days. Okay, not the next week, not the next month, or oh, no, these days, this, this month, for example, uh, pero no algo a futuro. Es decir, no quiero que me digan, por ejemplo, el 20, 
24 de diciembre. No, voy a hacer esto. No. No. Cosas que desde ya están haciendo, aunque sea por un periodo prolongado de tiempo. Porque esa es el, eh, la forma en que estamos viendo el present continuous ahorita, ¿verdad? To describe ongoing activities. O sea, actividades que están siendo ejecutadas, que estamos haciendo en este tiempo. Puede ser en este mismo momento o cosas que estoy haciendo en el trabajo. Ok, I estoy uh, haciendo el cierre del fin de mes o estoy preparando las ofertas de fin de año o estoy organizando eh, tal cosa, ¿verdad? O cuestiones de la familia o cuestiones personales que les está, que están haciendo. ¿Me explico? Entonces, eh, eso, eso es lo que van a hacer. Y eh, lo vemos mañana. Le... Hola. Disculpe, ah, no vamos a revisar lo de la plataforma. Exacto. Sobre a eso. La crisis y la... Gracias. A eso voy. Gracias. Bien. Hay un ejercicio en la tarea 13 que está dando, tiene un error. Como les decía, se supone que ya lo habían arreglado hoy. Ah, bueno, todo el mundo está en clase, todo el mundo está en la plataforma, con el lenta a esta hora. Oh, pero demasiado. Ok. 15 en la 13. Déjenme revisar si ya me aparece corregido. Que no les quiero dar toda la respuesta. No. Oh. Sí, no, la respuesta. No. Es diciembre, pero no soy Santa Claus. Está bueno. Mentira, teacher, ya lo hice. Ya lo hice. Yo sé, yo Mentira, sé. teacher, ya lo hice. Eh, broma. Ok, el ejercicio 2 tiene un problemita. O sea, eso se lo voy a, a enseñar. Acá está. Vean, en el ejercicio, bueno, acá en estos ejercicios lo que tienen que encontrar es el error, ¿verdad? Entonces dice, I am writing a memo right now. Y al hacer la respuesta, claro, el error es esta palabra, está mal escrita. Pero en la respuesta ya no ponen la palabra write. ¿Verdad? Entonces, yo no sé si alguien lo puede hacer en este momento. Y pruebe poniendo, I am writing a memo right now. A ver. A memo right now. Uno. Vamos a dar enviar. Cero. Miren, no me lo toma bien. Porque le puse la palabra right. La voy a quitar.
Y ahora sí, me lo toma bueno. ¿Ven? Tiene este errorcito, este ejercicio. Lo reporté ayer, dicen que ya lo arreglaron, pero todavía ya lo volví a reportar ahora. Bueno, esto me lo reportaron ustedes mismos, ¿verdad? Solo lo estoy haciendo del conocimiento de todos. Eh, de ahí, bueno, esto es, no sé si alguien ha encontrado otro error en otra, en otra tarea de aquí a la 15, porque me reportaron uno de la 16, pero ese es de la unidad 4. Lo vemos la otra semana. Pero había otro, el, así es. ¿De cuál es el? El WAS. El hace en la 15. En la 15, ¿verdad? Pero yes. son todas bien, dicho. Sí, esta es lo Esa que... Esa es también. Ajá. Esta es lo que dice que puede dar respuestas positivas o negativas. ¿Verdad? Y se las va a tomar bien. Y están bien escritas, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, aquí le puse yes, I was. Si contesto, no, I was. Y este tema que ni lo hemos visto y está en la unidad 4, pero aquí aparece en la tarea 15. ¿Verdad? Que no lo hemos visto, por lo menos en esta, en esta, en este módulo. Sí, ya lo vimos creo que en el módulo anterior. Pero, en, pero igual no hay wasen también lo toma bueno ok entonces como son preguntas de sí o no ya sea que la responda sí o que la responda no pero sea con la forma correcta se las va a tomar bien ok ¿Alguien más había encontrado algo por ahí? No, che. Ok. Oh, yes. Okay, so I'm going to take this last attendance. Verdad? So please, cameras on and respond. All right. Joanna Beatriz Orellana. La, ya fue. Ya se fue. Ok. Salud, Lulu. Eh, Silvio Enrique Cortés. Present teacher. Good night. Good night, Silvio. See you tomorrow. Remember, tomorrow finish section three. Ok. Completed section three. La plataforma. Silvia Zuleima Rodríguez. Silvia Zuleima. Ok. Y le escuché el pre. Good night, Zuleima. See you tomorrow, ok. Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Present teacher. Teacher tomorrow. Tomorrow, see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Teacher. Hola. Ya me mencionó. Sí, ¿dónde andabas? No, hombre, es que cerré esto sin querer. I am present, teacher. Ok. I am Ok, Joana. You can go to sleep. Ok, okay thank in, you. In peace. <laughs> <laughs> Carlos Alberto Meléndez, no, okay. 
Uh, Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present teacher. Mayra, are you at work? Are you still at work? Mayra? Not the teacher, no, I am in my house now. Uh, okay, because the personal session is with you. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, perfect. So don't go. Uh, Irma de Los Angeles Flores. Present teacher. Okay. Have a good night, Irma. See good you night, tomorrow. Teacher. See you tomorrow. Angel Alexander Guardado. Present teacher. Okay, see you. Carla Veronica Suria. Present teacher. Okay, Carla, have a good night. Good night, see you. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, good night. Ana good Marisol night. Mendoza. Present. Okay, see you. See you. Linda Stephanie Ramirez, didn't show up. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Present teacher. Okay, Alejandra, have a good night. Good night. Ana Delmi Herrera, didn't show up today. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Okay, Xiomara. See you tomorrow. Senaida America Dominguez. See you tomorrow, teacher. Present teacher. See you tomorrow. See you. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Okay, see you tomorrow. See you. Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay, you sound tired. See you. Yes. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present teacher. Okay, see you tomorrow. See you. Good night. Okay, Myra, how are you? How can I help you? Hi, teacher. Um, yeah, I I need to explain again mm -hmm. when I use uh, ing because I have a problem in the homework thirteen. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay. okay. What is your problem with the homework? Let's see that first. Is is all the the sentence is incorrect oh. when I I write? Fifteen, uh, third. Okay. For for example, the, the number the number three, the secretary and I am checking documents right now. Aha, uh -huh. what is the mistake? Um maybe I you I uh, maybe don't use the bird to be. The verb is, is there. Is there. Yeah, this is the verb be. Mm -hmm. But is the correct form? Mm, I, I don't know. Okay, what is the subject in this sentence? The subject is the, the secretary and I. Ah, correct. The secretary and I. Yeah. We're talking about two people. Yeah. So what should be the form, uh, the verb be? The secretary and I. Yeah. We. 
is a R. Exactly. Okay. Okay. So the, the problem is am. Um, must okay. be R. The secretary and I are checking documents right now. Um, okay. And, and the first teacher of uh, my boss traveling to Colombia for training about sales. Uh huh. I, 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 I need it's correct, teacher Mint. No, there is a mistake. There is something missing. Uh huh. Okay. My boss traveling to Colombia for training about sales. What is missing? Um, I I think the missing is that traveling. Uh -huh. My boss travel to no. <gasps> yeah, when you say my boss travel is correct, but it's not present progressive, it's not present continuous. Entonces eso no lo podemos cambiar, aunque es una oración correcta, pero es otro tiempo. Uh -huh. Y el que estamos probando, estamos practicando, es el present continuous. Okay. Uh -huh, yeah. no, no. Porque la, la oración es, mi jefe está viajando a Colombia. Y ahí le falta algo. Ah, the verb to be. Ah, correct. Ok, ok, Where? I understand. My boss is traveling to yes, Colombia. Yes, here. Okay, I. Oh, and, uh -huh. and then when I use the verb, the, the ing, I, that structure is the subject, the verb to be, um, verb plus ing. Yes. Okay, okay. That is the Let me show you. Okay. So, okay, I understand that. It's, all, it's only my, 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 my question teacher, I. You see, this is the structure as I was telling. Okay. Yeah, subject, then verb be. Depending on the subject, you're going to use am, is or are okay and the verb in the ing form ing. okay plus the complement okay okay that is the proper structure for this okay teacher okay let's practice a little bit because we have time yeah and uh, let me show you this Okay, I hope you can see the picture. But actually, you don't need to see the picture. You need to complete the sentences with the correct form of verb B. How would you complete the first one? The first? This one. Oh, wait, wait. Um, it, the, the screen is the, ah, ya lo, the, perdón, no lo veía donde estaba ubicado. Okay. In, in, in the examples? Uh-huh. Oh, we are obtaining. Where the... is John? Donde está John, 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 John? Aquí está John. No, yeah. Más o menos se ve la imagen. Yeah. Fíjese que yo estoy viendo el libro. No el libro. Si... Ah, bueno, ¿Sí? permítame, entonces no se me movió aquí la... ¿Ahora? Um, yeah. En esta imagen. Here, this is John. 
John, ok. Está con sus audífonos, verdad, sentado ahí. Ahí está John. Entonces, ¿cómo quedaría esta oración? And the first is John is listening to music. Correcto, muy bien. La segunda es sobre Anne. Vamos a ver uh -huh. dónde está Anne. Aquí está. Uh -huh. This is Anne. Um, the bear is walk. Uh -huh. Okay. And mm -hmm. is walk, walking in the street. Ah, is that correct according to the picture? No, because the and uh, is in the bicycle. Entonces, ¿cómo debe ser la oración? And um, so is neg negative. Oh, yeah, yeah, I understand that. Okay. And isn't mm -hmm. walking in the street? Yes, correct. And isn't walking in the street. One more. Okay. Mr. Cardoso and Miss Keen. Here they are. Cardoso. Mr. Cardoso <clears throat> and Miss Keen. Okay. Mr. Cardoso and Miss Keen are sitting on the train. Yes. Okay. Train. Yeah, that's train. Right. Okay. Are sitting on the train. Okay. 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 Very good. Very good. You got it. Entonces, es, puedes hacer los ejercicios del libro y de la plataforma. Yeah. Esto es. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Any other question? No. Okay, Mayra. Thank you for attending. Okay. Yeah. See good you. Good night. Good night. Bye bye.